Welcome to the Shifting with Marley podcast. I'm Marley. Thank you for joining me wherever you are. All that I ask of you, the listener, is to have an open mind and an open heart. And in return, I offer you myself. I want to tell you a story. A story about a civilization. Now, this civilization functions on certain core values, which include equality, cooperation, respect, justice, understanding, freedom, peace, truth, knowledge, and love. This civilization is focused on community. And each person recognizes their place among the community and among the larger civilization. With this community, everyone is supported. Everyone has their needs met. Everyone helps each other. And resources are shared. Poverty no longer exists. And extreme wealth no longer exists. The civilization is not run by or driven by money or competition. Instead, each person in this civilization is guided and supported to learn, to grow, and to find their passions. Success is defined by those people living in alignment with their purpose. Everyone contributes to the community. Everyone has a role to play. And everyone has a voice and a say. This civilization does not use fossil fuels for energy, but instead lives in harmony with the earth and the seasons. Each person recognizes their connection to the earth. All community decisions are made for the good of all and in respect for the earth. War and conflict are a thing of the past because everyone understands that everything and everyone on this planet are connected. The illusion of separateness has dropped. The masculine and feminine are balanced and in harmony. Nature is allowed to be There is peace, there is abundance, and there is happiness. Most importantly, there is love. This civilization could be our future. In this time of great change and transition, it is of the utmost importance to hold the vision for this future. If we can dream it, if we can visualize it, we can make it a reality. We have each chosen to be alive here and now, together, to create this new world, this new earth, and we each have a role to play. We each have a purpose in making this new earth a reality. Each of us matters, and it is incumbent upon each of us to find our purpose and calling. The time for change is upon us. The time for creation is here. What if I told you that this new earth was inevitable? But when we get to this new world and how we get there, that's up to us. If you doubt me, think of this. Our current reality, our current society That's all a product of human creation. Humans made it. So you see, we have the power to make a new world, create a new reality. We each are here now to birth this new world. It's already begun. We're already in labor. It's already happening. We're much closer than you think. If we are in labor birthing the new world. We're already 10 centimeters dilated and it's time to push. And it's going to be hard and messy and painful. 
but we're near the end. And when it's over, we'll have a new world. I will tell you, I am so grateful to be alive now with you, you beautiful, beautiful soul, creating a new world, a world with a foundation of love, love for ourselves, love for each other, love for each animal, and immense love for the planet. Hold the vision for this future in your mind's eye. Feel it. Visualize the world you want to live in. Dream it. Write it down. Speak it out loud. Have a conversation about it. Let's talk about it. And together, let's make it a reality. Keep the faith. Hold the vision. And trust. <laughs>